<laughs> Josh! How does it feel? Do you enjoy all those emotions that my sisters got to feel once, one year ago? Only, only guess what? They didn't get to laugh it off. No! 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 They're gone! Jessica's fucking dead. What? Did you hear me? Jessica is dead. And you were gonna fucking pay, you ah! dick! What happened? Jess, Mike? I don't remember killing Jess. Jesus Christ. Oh, God. Oh, my God, Matt! مصيبة اللي قاعد يصير شنو هذا؟ يعني هذا مو مات في ناس ثانية. Revelation. ما ادري ايش السالفه ما ادري شو اللي قاعد يصير هذاك منو السترينجر شو السالفه ابيض ابيض تكفى ابيض ايوه ان هذا اشكال انه ما يذبح جاش Not a bad. Did not saw the the other bad or the Okay. 
ولّر هذا مات وينه؟ ظهر وقت ومات مختفي Are you all right? I didn't think that I'd make it. You were screaming I, bloody I, I murder. You look totally wild. There was something. Where's Matt? Come sit down, sit down. Something's out there. Did you there. guys split up? A monster is in Wait. Mom? Are you okay? What are you talking about? I said there's something out like there. Like what? Gosh, relax, it was Josh, it was all Josh. No, 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 listen to we me. We got him tied up, he can't hurt you. No, it was after me and it wasn't human. Hold on. Wait, Em, where's Matt? Is he okay? I don't want to talk about that fucking sack of shit. Wow. He left me. He just fucking abandoned me when I was hanging off that goddamn tower about to die. What tower? And then I, I fell into this terrifying freaking mine shaft and he was just gone. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What, what mine shaft? I, I was walking down there in the mines and it was dark and I found this pile and there was Beth's head. Wait, what? Beth's head, I found oh it. Oh my god. What the fuck? Are you serious? Yes, I'm serious. Listen, in in the tower, there was there was a radio, and, and I got through to someone, but then that was right when the tower collapsed. Em, you made it. Oh god, yeah, yeah, Mike. Barely. What about Matt? We're trying to figure that out. Yeah, and then there was this monster that was chasing her. I... She's all messed up, guys. Emily, hey, Em. Whoa. What can that be? Josh. Jess? It's not Jess. Sorry, man, but who is it? I don't know. We should check it out. I got your back. <laughs> I got your back, good luck. Already, whoever it is is probably gone by now. I, unless you want me to take the gun. No, no, no. I think that's less good. You do the door. I got the gun. Oh! 
Hold on there. Hold on there, mister. Freeze. Ah, oh, what? All right, all right. Just take it easy, Grandpa. Okay, everybody, just calm down. Oh! Now, what? Move over there. Go on, move. Let me say what I came to say. I'm here to tell you what you're up against being back on this mountain. You should never have returned. I don't know why you did after what happened last year. You mean with Hannah and Beth? Yeah, how could you know without being involved? Oh, we're responsible. You hold on to your horses. I don't take kindly to you kids coming up here to my mountain. Your mountain? Huh? I'm sure the Washingtons would be very surprised to hear that. <laughs> well, the mountain don't belong to me, it's true. But it don't belong to the Washingtons. This mountain belongs to the Wendigo. <laughs> Who? What's he talking about? What the hell's a Wendigo? Let's hear him out. Not like we have a choice. Now, I'm only gonna tell you this once. It doesn't matter to me if you believe it or not. I got reasons I wanna get it off my chest. See? I told you. He's guilty as shit. Guilty as something. Shut up, Mike. There is a curse that dwells in these mountains. Should any man or woman resort to cannibalism in these woods, the spirit of the Wendigo shall be unleashed. Oh, crap. Oh. You're gonna need to find somewhere safe. The basement might be okay. Okay, get down there now, all of you, and wait. What? Why? For how long? Until dawn. Guys, I ran off and left Josh when I heard screaming. Where did you leave him? In the shed. Uh, your friend will already be dead. No. No, he can't be. We, we were just with him. A lot can happen quickly on this mountain. No. I, I'm not letting anything else happen to him. Anything else? What What do you mean? Uh, Chris, don't. I hit him. We thought he'd killed Jessica, and, and, and so he got me riled up. And I hit him in the head. Chris! Maybe he deserved it. No matter what, we can't just let him die. Then I'll go with you. I, I don't need your help. Hey, going alone is suicide. Fine. The rest of you, get down to the basement. Be safe, and don't go outside again until we're back. You don't seem to understand the magnitude of the situation. Well, I'm going to get Josh, aren't I? No, I'm going to get Josh. You're going to help me. Do you understand? Uh, yeah, I think so. You need to follow me and do everything I tell you. خازو قاعد يساعدهم This is the end you point towards the thing you want to kill. I know how to use a shotgun, man. No you don't. What? How do you know? Trust me. I know. Hey. Come back safe. Oh. We need to hurry, son. See you soon. So, so, so tell me, you're the expert on these things. What's uh, what, what, what's a guy got to know? You just be careful. You follow my lead. Lahdes, so, Lahdes. How many times do I have to shoot it with the shotgun before it's dead? Well, you be shooting it a long time. You, you mean this thing won't even kill it? No, it'll slow it down. Well, how do you kill it? They don't like fire. I don't like fire. They fear it. And it can kill them if you have to. See, their skin is like... It's like tough armor. Unless you burn it off first. It's gross. Well, what, what are these things like? I mean, are they just crazy unpredictable, or... I mean, can you figure out what they're gonna do? Well, they adhere to some pattern, like any animal. 
poor human. What, you mean like how? Like they've got schedules? Well, they only hunt at night. Oh. Why? I didn't ask. Well, I'll film, film, and let him film. Pro Wendigo tips? Like if I rub garlic all over me, they won't be able to smell me or something? Uh, they'll still smell you. Anything like that? I can't see you if you're standing still. It's like toads. <laughs> Sight is based on changes of movement in their field of vision. So if I don't move, I, I'm. You didn't see anything yet, huh? <laughs> Josh, he could still be out there. <laughs> First, the Wendigo. He'll render you immobile. And then he strips the skin off of your entire body, piece by piece. And then he keeps you alive and aware and feasts on your organs, one piece at a time. So I'll watch that. Let's go now. Might still be near. Another. Oh my god, guys, thank god. It took you so long. It's not so good up there right now. Understatement of the night. Chris, where's the flamethrower guy? Uh, yeah, he, uh... He didn't make it? No. What happened? The thing, it, uh, tore him apart. Right in front of me. Oh, god. All right, these are all the doors? Yeah. Are you sure? What are you looking for? Another way out. Mike, look, I really don't think that's a good idea. We should stay put right here until dawn. At least we're safe down here. Oh, yeah? All wrapped up like a little present with a bow on top for that thing to tear us apart on Christmas morning? People will come for us in the morning. You don't sound so sure. That is what'll happen, right, Em? Yeah, I, I mean, right? Well, you can wait. I'm leaving. Mike, there's no key for the cable car. Josh, he's got to have it. Josh? One of his dirty little tricks. Great, great. 
that fucking thing got a hold of Josh, then we're shit out of luck. I don't know, Mike. It's possible. What's possible? It may have taken him down to the mine. What? I saw some horrible stuff down there. I think it's where that thing lives, and... Huh. M. What? Fuck it. I'm gonna get that key, right from that thing's goddamn bedroom, and then I'm gonna get us all the hell out of here. And what is all that? It's, uh, that old guy's bag. Is that a map? <gasps> that guy was prepared for anything. <laughs> Not quite. What is this place? Oh, my God. Wait, wait, wait. What is that? I was down there. It was horrible. You were? There had been a cave-in in the 50s, I guess, and these miners got trapped down there. God. Some of them survived, but like 15 of them didn't make it. There was this reporter, and I think he figured out there had been some like big cover up going on. I found these plans. They knew the mine was a death trap, but they let the miners keep working anyway. And I'm not sure what it means, but I found this chair. Dried blood all over the place, like somebody had been tortured. Michael, I'd like to maybe focus on how we're going to get the fuck <laughs> out of here, please. I'm just saying, it's weird how much crazy shit's gone on up here. What's weird is that there's a tunnel leading from the lodge to the sanatorium, see? That's how I got back here. I saw this when I was down there. That's where it lives. Um, um, what is, huh? What is that? Ash, um, oh my god, oh my god, it's, oh my it's god. It's nothing, oh, no, it just, no, it, no, it bit no, me no. and. It bit you, what bit you? The, the Wendigo. The what? It's nothing, really. It's not a big deal. You okay? Shit. It doesn't hurt anymore, really. It's, it's not that bad. Em, if that thing bit you... I, I know what you're thinking, and I'm fine. Are you? Yes. Emily, at least let us check it out. Emily, if the Wendigo bit you, you could turn into one of those things. Oh, that's ridiculous. He said it was from eating each other. Remember, he said oh, that. Is that how it works? Yes. It happens. If it bit you, you're going to turn into one, and then you're going to turn on us. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You can't be down here with us. What? Mike. You got to go. Are you kidding me? You're putting us all in danger. Like hell I am. Emily. You can't stay here. Mike, just cool your head, okay? We don't know if it works like that. Maybe it's just a bite. I've seen what these fuckers can do. And I don't want to say it again. What is this? Guys, oh, what are you doing? Door's right here. I am letting you do this voluntarily. Oh, no. You're just making yourself feel better about sending me to my death since you know there's a Wendigo out there ready to rip me to pieces like it did with... Okay, oh my god, will you just go? Go, get out of here! Whoa, okay. Whoa, 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 Mike, calm down. Oh, how the luck, You're gonna shoot me? Mike, me? This is the safe room, M. Please. It is not safe as long as you're in it. Not for us. Don't, don't do this! I'm really sorry. an eye on her. If you see anything weird, you guys know what to do. Yeah. No one leave. Okay? It's not safe out there. I'll be back soon. We hope you did the right things with Josh back then. Good job, you picked and saved over Josh. Hey, 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 h
Now we don't have a chance. No, got it. It just means we've got to be tough. We've got to do this on our own. I don't know if I can. Wait, she's not the bad. Only a few men have dared to hunt the wind. This guy's a little OCD. Khalnigra? Hunt Wendigos, I am the only man who has ever kept them the under control. Heed these words, or it shall be your death, and your death will not be the last. The Wendigos must be contained. The Wendigos grow out of cannibalism with the human, the despite of the cave, Caravan's food, trapped on the mountain in the fierce. Winter storms, when he eats and nothing has much days, when the spirit will become possessed, even the strongest man is weak, uh, weak to it. He will kill without remorse, often those companions who have traveled with him, he will eat the flesh raw, the corpse, and I will see what that happened many years ago, craving the flesh, the container be changed, and then... I'm glad I have seen that happen many years ago. I am craving, uh, craving for flesh that cannot be sated. And then the cringe begins, change begins. The eyes turn first and become mil milky and white. Then the teeth become larger, longer, and like fangs. And the creature grows skin pale across the bones. Oh, the journal is the account of the Wendigos. Riwiz, thank you for the other. I have a hat on the ghetto. I notice you, Riwiz. I notice you. Welcome, welcome, man. <laughs> but the ghetto. If you are reading this, you will have questions. But I do not have all the answers. This is all evidence and stories of my experience. Liars, local man found dead. Oba. There was a tribe that lived the mountain, the Cree. Their shamans. A lot of history to this. Shamans tell stories of a tall creature born in ice. The tribe respected. The mountain and all of the animals which lived on it. The mountain became sacred to the Cree. Every animal became scared. Also, the Cree believed it was bad luck to harm an animal on the mountain and would hunt elsewhere. Uh, the miners, the miners arrived and found found tin and later traces. Radium, they mined deep into the sacred mountain. The Cree say that mountain cried out and the spirit was released. Bad. Combat. The Wendigo eyes change will become both sharper and more dim. The it says that because the Wendigos are mutated from humans, when they hunt us, they know how to perfectly mimic their prey. The bite won't harm her. Ah, okay. The one, uh, the one to go see his movement. It's, uh, it is a hunter, like a hawk. But it cannot see stillness if you are to keep totally still, like, then the Wendigo will not be able to see you. The skin, the flesh of the Wendigo are hard, like armor, they seem to feel no pain, they cannot be cut or stabbed, bullets will not pierce their skin. Chesi! And he shot Garma Sawanum Shay! Uh, they cannot be cut, stabbed. Their skin through the shotgun will keep them at bay. You know, though a shotgun will keep them at bay. Oh, nice. Because the Wendigos is mutated for human. It knows how to hunt us. It's like, it can be perfectly mimic its prey. You must remain sharp and disciplined. 
I have killed six Wendigos. Knife or bullet will not harm them. Use a flamethrower. It is the best weapon. Fire envelops. Uh, then burns away their skin and make them weak. But try not to kill them. Killing a Wendigo should be the last resort. Death resistless releases the Wendigo spirit into the air. I have contained them. I use traps to catch them and fire to drive them into cages. The traps were baited with human lamps from those who had no further use for them. One by one, I caught those who had infested the mountain. Bad? Allah. There are many be uh true? Oh. oh no 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 what? no no What is it? What does it say? It says that the bites it, if it bites you it's not infectious. It doesn't do anything. Let me see uh, that. I'm sorry, what did you say? Um, it says she'll be okay. It says what? You're gonna be fine. Fine? Michael almost shot me, is that she fine? She didn't shoot you. And this bitch almost let him. Hey, that's not fair, she was scared. I'm the one who's scared. I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Emily. I didn't know what was going to happen. There's none of us know. There's no excuse, there's no excuse, Please, Emily. Emily. Please, just try to understand. Understand the palm of my hand, bitch. Oof! I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. We've got to get to Mike. Like, now. Well, the Musaddas, the Musaddas. Sarat, Sarat. Joshua, oh! you should have listened to me. Because of your choices, people have died. I don't know which is worse, actively triggering events that lead to someone's death, or passively allowing a tragedy to occur. Because you couldn't lift a goddamn finger to help someone else. Oh, for my Josh? Remember last year? Huh? Are you left your poor sisters to die? You did nothing to help them. Paralyzed by your own self-centered fear. While a real threat was closing in. No, it's all about you, Josh. It's always all about you. Your game has gone terribly wrong. And your friends, like your sisters, have deserted you. You're all alone. Can you feel how cold your loneliness has become? Huh? Why did you hurt them? Joshua, why did you hurt them? Well, they didn't hurt you, Joshua. Not intentionally. They made a stupid mistake, and a terrible tragedy befell your sisters. They did not intend for that to happen. It just did. And they were sorry, at least, until you subjected them to your night of horrific torture. Let's hope that it's not too late for atonement. And that your friends, if they still are your friends, can save you from this terrible isolation. 